wise words, wise advice to human beings. You can say what you will. Ah, oh, that Bible stuff, there's nothing to that. Ha. I'll start with Proverbs 14. I told you, go through the Proverbs. There's about 30 of them. 30 chapters of them. You have uh, 31. 31 chapters. You say, you expect me to read through that? Take the first chapter and read it. Lean back in your chair and you say, is that me? Or am I somebody else? Am I a false prophet? A hateful individual? A belligerent, hateful, self-seeking, wicked, evil person? You're either behaving in a godly manner or you're not. Your behavior tells everyone who you are. Get on the narrow road. Not many find it. Most of them go down the wide road. The wise woman, is this you girls? The wise woman builds her house. He's not talking about nail the boards together. She's part of the structure of her family. A wise woman builds her house, but with her own hands. She gets up in the morning and she is part, a gigantic part of the family structure ladies. The foolish woman tears her house down. If you could see flashback at the women that tear their house down, a mighty throne. There's just no godliness there. He or she whose walk is upright fears the Lord. Now they can make all the fun they want to out of people like me and you when you just walk upright. He whose walk is upright or she fears the Lord but he whose ways are devious despises the Lord. Which group are you with? Oh, don't kid yourself. You're in one or the other. A fool's talk brings a rod to his back. You out there saying foolish things over and over and over. But the lips of the wise protects them. There's protection in doing and saying to the best of your ability what is right and good and righteous and holy. Where there are no oxen, big animals, the manger is empty Just think about a world where there was no mechanization, no tractors, no plows being dragged by a machine, no bush hogs, no backhoes, no track holes, no bulldozers. Think about how hard it would be if all you had was just animals. But from the strength of an ox, 
comes an abundant harvest. Back in the day, no mechanized, all animal, oxen pulling plows, mules, horses. Boy, you talk about work. A truthful witness does not deceive. A truthful witness does not deceive. Here's what I saw. Here is what happened. And they tell the truth. But a false witness pours out lies. Make stuff up. You make enough stuff up when you're dealing with your neighbor and he'll look at you and say, that guy, that woman running her mouth. The mocker, and I mean, these United States of America are full of mockers. A mocker seeks wisdom and finds none. Bad mouthing the creator of the cosmos who made him. Knowledge comes easily to the discerning. Fear God, do what's right. What's wrong with Jesus? Why don't you try Jesus? He loves you. He doesn't want anyone to perish, but to come to repentance. Get on the right road. Knowledge comes easily to the discerning. <laughs>